1984. I saw an ad in the newspaper about a house-sitting job. Alrighty. Since I was short on cash, I decided to sign up. All right. Okay. Feet finder is a thing. I know a girl that actually uh, started selling feet pics. Yeah, I'm dating her. No, I'm kidding. But <laughs> quite an eerie neighborhood. Yeah, this, you know what? This is kind of eerie. What's up, neighbor? Maxime's house. Excuse me, I'm trying to find a house on this street. Could you help me out? What house are you looking for? I'm looking for Maxime's place. He hired me to look after him while he's away. Maxime, huh? That's interesting. He usually asks me to watch his place. I'm Marco Botowski, by the way. Nice to meet you, Marco. Can you tell me where his house is? Two houses down. Mine's right here. Our neighbor Sabo in the middle. In the Maxime's place. You can't miss it. Thank you, Marco. Controlling the lights, temperature. What are you what are you talking about? That that sounds convenient. Disappearances happening around here, but mainly because our neighbor Sabo got one and won't stop raving about it. He left for vacation after installing it, said it has built-in surveillance systems and all. Guess you wanted to keep an eye on things while he's away. Well, I hope you enjoy setting it up. Thanks again for the direction, Marco. Thank you, Marco. You seem like a nice guy. Martovsky sounds, you know, a little Bulgarian, I'm getting. I don't know why. Marto. Maybe not. Maybe Russian. Don't really sound Polish. Maybe, uh, I don't know. I'm going to stick with that Bulgarian answer. This must be it. Alrighty. Let's get it, man. Oh, shit. I'm walking into the walls. I think the homeowner mentioned the keys would be in the backyard. Don't mind if I do. I will go and check. Put it in the flower pots. Alright. Not really well hidden. See if these work. Beautiful chime bells, by the way. Belling and shit. I wonder what life would be like if I was a bell. Anyways. Fantastic. Dark as hell in here, dude. Where are the lights at? Um. Oh, they just automated and shit. Where? That is pretty welcoming. Did say it was a smart house. Yo, uh, Maxime, clean up after yourself, dude. I'm not your chef, all right? Fruit Loops? I love Fruit Loops. Okay. Read note on fridge. Thanks for house sitting. Please make sure to check the mailbox, water the plants, throw out the trash. All right, dude. Look, I ain't your maid, man. Press Q to toggle the lights on and off in, my, in any room. Once you're finished, help yourself with food in the kitchen. All right. <laughs> clap, clap. Look, this is how it be with shoddy. <laughs> Yo, it's like, I'm 20-something years old making these jokes, and it's like, anyways, let's get the mail, man. No pun intended. Right? You know, we don't really fuck with mail, actually. I didn't want it. This uh, throughout is disgusting garbage. Oh, I gotta explore rooms first. Alright. Okay, some dry now. Not good for your toilets, actually. Bathroom in it. Nice little echo in the garage. Bedroom. Another bedroom. Yo, quit these doors closing and shit. 
My bad with the painting, man. Didn't mean it. Fuck you, Maxine. It's a gay ass name, too. Nice. Are these doors closing? I'm not fucking with it. Right. Now, like, what can be so scary about this? Let's get the mail. Missing. Please help. Chem call Zexon. This guy probably made the game. <laughs> yeah. 25 years old, 170 pounds, 5 foot 9. It's like about my height. You know, he's a little fatter than me, you fat piece of. Nah, I'm kidding. Great weight. It's a little overweight. But you know, if you go to the gym, nothing. Nothing that bad. Watering plants. Where's a uh, Where's the flower pot at? All right. How do you expect me to water these plants with no flower with water pot? Like, all right, Maxine. Making this shit a little too difficult for me. Maybe it's in here. Oh shit. Didn't mean to do that. Water the plants. Alright, now let me water the plants. Oh, from the garage. Yeah, I should probably like read. I got it. Why do I keep clapping, dude? Okay. Oh, oh shit. Oh, I got the garage wet. My bad, Maxine. Didn't mean it. Okay. Let's rotate. Nice. Look, actually, look, you probably don't even know this. You can't drown the plant. If you drown the plant, These are the right plants? Shit. Oh. Why are we watering these? All right. Damn thirsty plant. Damn, I'm thirsty, thirsty. I feel like we got unlimited water, so. No, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna just hold it. Just like that Hermione backpack, just doesn't end. This a cool little pond though. Reminds me of a uh, Shaq's goldfish pond. I don't know why I know that though. Like I'm an odd person for knowing that. All right. Look like weeds though, low key. Maxime hired me to babysit. It's low key kind of frustrating. I didn't sign up. Actually, wait, is this what housekeeping does? Is this what it involves? I guess it does, right? If you babysit, you take care of the baby. But if you house it, you take care of the house. Oh, all right. There's bones in it? Dog. All right, let's go. Open the door. Open the door, man. <coughs> Fucking piece of shit. <clears throat> I'm cool and shit. Like, I, I really didn't even get scared. Nothing at all. Uh, well, I didn't get scared, did he? I didn't actually get scared of it. Agent Ristoli Ristolino. 
Sounds like a type of pasta. FBI, I need to ask you a few questions. What's this about, Mr. Tortellini? There have been reports of disturbances in this area, disappearances, strange phenomena. We're conducting an investigation. Everything's fine here, it's taking out the trash, sir. Are you sure? We've reason to believe there's more to this neighborhood than meets the eye. Who said that? Is this guy Optimus Prime? 100% just taking out the trash, man. Keep your eyes and ears open. We need to get to the bottom of this. Yes, sir. It's that easy. That guy needs to, like, relax, though, walking up on people like that. Like, not me, but you could have gave someone a heart attack, you know? Damn. Sweet. Fuck. Damn it. Close! I hate this. There we go. There we go. Nice. I earned myself a little goldfish. Like, who having sex? What's going on? Hello? Who clapping cheeks? Because I didn't clap. What's going on? Oh, Shiza. Wait, no, I'm kind of hungry, though. Hold on. Kind of hungry. Like, I should check upstairs, but low key. Yeah, bro, didn't even leave me shit. He's an actual asshole. Come on, man. He didn't leave me anything. Oh, I thought this was a bed. I said, like, why the hell you got a toilet in your fucking. <laughs> Alright. What's going on in here, man? Marco? I should grab something to eat and go to sleep. You're going to sleep already? It's like, it's like they want to jump scare me, you know? But it's like, it's not going to happen. Nah, we chilling. Nothing. Yo, he's actually like a loser, bro. Oh, great. He left me Fruit Loops. This has been rotting in milk for how long? Put cereal on bed upstairs. Nice. Oh, it's bedtime. Oh, it's a great game. This is a great game. Am I going to eat it or am I just going to stare at it? Okay. Let's watch the news. It's a lovely day. I'm more concerned about my cereal. Is that Darth Maul? All right, look, I'm going to be completely honest. Let me close this fucking door, okay? Um, if I hear some something, right, and I'm all alone, I'm not investigating. I'm not doing that. I'm going to just pretend that I'm dead in my bed, actually. Oh, someone got to me before you. Sorry. Sorry, bro. I'm not a pussy. No. Oh. Right. Don't remember grabbing an impact grill and taking the door off before I went to bed, so this is quite peculiar. Interesting situation we got going on. Yo, quit clapping, bro. Clap, clap.
Maybe he just had the shit. You like this bathroom better? No, this is not a bathroom. Oh, fuck. Nah, you know what? Let me uninstall this shit, actually. Hey, man. Rubber ducky? No! No, there's so many rubber duckies! Squeak, squeak! <laughs> Dude, fuck that house, dude. Oh shit, yeah, I'm out of here, bro. No, I'm chilling. <laughs> I'm chilling, bro. You know what? You can keep the money too. You can keep the fucking money, bro. Damn it, son. I'm out. Peace out. <laughs> Let me leave. Oh shit. Like, I wasn't actually, like, that was, like, light as fuck. Like, I wasn't scared or nothing. I kept running until I reached the nearest police station. <laughs> <laughs> Broke-ass motherfucker came in for the Uber. While investigating, the authorities found Marco's lifeless body in his house. Meanwhile, Maxine's remains were found stuffed in the trash bag outside his house. Their neighbor, na neighbor Sabo, has disappeared under similar circumstances. His, rem his remains have yet to be found. Despite the eerie scratches on the walls and my harrowing account, no trace of the creature is ever discovered. Damn. The case remains unsolved. Yeah, that shit was cool. Do people enjoy making games? Actually. Hey man, shout out Ray. No, I like a game that's